Good morning. I wanted to talk about the rapture. I really think if the rapture is to occur uh, during this blood moon, I first of all have great expectations uh, with the events that have occurred already. Uh, that being the Shanghai blood red sky occurring and and other reports of birds fall, falling from the sky according to Hosea 5 I think it's Hosea 4 or 5 um, these are predicted events that are to occur and with the lawlessness and all the other scriptures that are being fulfilled I uh, I think that we have ourselves a possibility of a rapture occurring any time, any, it, it could happen any time. Now, what we need to do to prepare our hearts is to be in a daily practice of talking to the Lord, getting our hearts ready, like that daily spiritual discipline, like praying, reading the word, getting the word in us, getting the whole armor of God on, according to Ephesians 6.10. And really, I remember we're in a spiritual warfare. So if you already haven't noticed, uh, with the Roe v. Wade, I, I had a dream about this that the last thing that was going to happen before the rapture was said, that the Roe v. Wade would overturn and the rapture would occur. And I feel like this is the, it. This is the spiritual battle we're in. So I wanted to share my thoughts on this. Um, I did have a blood red uh, sky dream about it occurring in Pittsburgh and it was a hockey night in Pittsburgh and the blood red sky loomed over and gangs were forming and a Russian security guard was laughing now that was years ago and it's just so interesting how events have turned since that time and I look at what's happening in the world and I think, wow, how relevant that dream is now. So uh, I wanted to share this uh, rapture, well, I guess dream and some thoughts on what I think is going to happen. But what I think isn't so much important as what the Bible says. The Bible says that these things are to happen and that they will be fulfilled before the time of the Lord. Now the day, the days are getting shorter. I think that uh, because the scriptures are being fulfilled, um, it's getting shorter because many people are not saved, have been witnessed to. Uh, the word has to be preached to all four corners of the world for the Jesus to come back. So if you haven't already noticed, there's a lot of ministries that are ministering to a lot of people, but there's still a lot of unsaved people. So if you have an opportunity to witness to someone, this might be the last of it, you know, uh, as far as I'm concerned. That's really what it comes down to, is being able to witness to people, but a lot of people are rejecting it, and they think it's silliness. Uh, they think the rapture is a big uh, fairy tale. So, uh, but for us, it's a reality. And we look forward to the day of the Lord. And we know the day is fast approaching. And with that, I 
I will sign off from here. Thank you for listening. Blessings to you.